One day, the family discovered the most gigantic wrinkleberry they'd ever seen. The trouble was, the wrinkleberry was at the very, very top of the wrinkleberry tree, and no one could reach it, not even George's mother and father. Suddenly, George's father got an idea. George, I'm going to scoop you up and balance you on my head so you can reach that huge wrinkleberry. Oh, no, 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 no. No way am I going up there. But his father reassured George. I'll take care of you, George. I'll keep you safe. You have to trust me. No, no. Definitely no. And, his father continued, you can have the very first bite of that giant, delicious wiggler. The first bite? Really? Wow. That's a big winkleberry. Hold on, George. Here we go. And with that, his father gently scooped George up on his head, and up George went. Up and up and up. Oh, oh, I don't think I like this. Exclaimed George, climbing higher and higher. Wow, it's neat up here. I can see forever. Wow, I'm taller than everybody. Reach up and get it, son. You're almost there. As George reached and stretched for the giant wrinkleberry, a most amazing thing happened. His neck began to grow, and grow, and grow, and grow. I could stay up here forever. Wow, I really like it up there. Why did you tell me it was so cool up there? What'd you say, George? I can't hear you. Why did you tell me it was... Wait a minute. I'm as tall as you are now. Wow, look at me. I like it up here. I could stay up here forever. And from that day on, George was never the same. He continued to grow and stretch and try new things, to go to new places and make new friends. And he wasn't afraid to stick his neck out anymore. Oh, I like that story. I like any story about long necks. <laughs> I didn't really want to come here today because I've never been here before, but I'm very glad I did. I'm glad you did too, Zigger. Sometimes going somewhere new is like sticking your neck out, and you took a chance. <laughs> and remember, you can come back anytime you like. I'm always here. I will, I will. Thank you. And so is the book tree. Super Gladys. Oh, I told you. You know, Zeker, I think your neck looks a little longer today. Really? <laughs> Do you think so? Oh, wow. <laughs> we gotta have more sleepovers, Duck. I'm having a great time. Me too. <sighs> you got enough blankets? Do you still have cold feet? Because I've got lots of socks. Uh, Bingo, there's something I gotta tell you. About my cold feet. I don't really have cold feet. I have another problem. What? Cold legs? Cold wings? No, no. It's kind of embarrassing. You can tell me. I'm your best bud, right? Uh, well, sometimes I quack in my sleep. You quack in your sleep? That's all? <laughs> That's nothing to worry about. <laughs> Let's hit the hay, buddy. Okay. Thanks, Bingo. I was worried about telling you. No problem. See you in the morning. What was that? Duck, what's that noise? Duck, Duck, be quiet. This is going to be a long night. Quack, 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 quack,
Definitely awake. I'm so wide awake, I could just. Hmm. I guess some rabbits just need more sleep than others. I'll just let them sleep. Night, night. postcard from Molly. Oh, what does it say? Um, dear Bingo and friends, that's us. <laughs> you were right. I'm having fun with Cousin Lou. Yesterday we went to a big park and I rode on a real merry-go-round. Wow! The smiling suitcase says hello. Smiling suitcase? What's that mean? Oh, you know Molly. Hmm. Uh, signed Molly the Adventurer. <laughs> should have fun. Hey, Zika, where are you going? To Mr. Growl's. He wants to see my space mole collection. Well, wait for us. Come on, everyone. Hey, 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 where's Bingo? Can you believe it? He's still in bed. At this hour. Yeah, <laughs> what a lazy bones. <laughs> Hurry up, you guys. Mr. Growl's waiting. Good to have you back, Molly. Thanks, Bingo. Did you see my postcard? Look at that merry-go-round. I went on that. Yeah, that's cool looking. What kind of animal did you ride on? Oh, I went on a giraffe. He was so funny. He went up and down and up and down. <laughs> did you get dizzy? Yeah, up and down, up and down. Hmm. Well, I just hope you sleep okay tonight and uh, you don't have any feathers in your bed tickling you. Feathers in my bed? Why? Because while you were gone, duck slept over. Hi, guys. Are you asleep yet? No. Good, because I had so much fun sleeping over, I decided to do it again. <laughs> uh, don't worry, Bingo. I don't need a bed. Uh, I brought my own blanket, and I can sleep right here on the floor next to you, my best buddy. I'll get the light, Bingo. Good night, Bingo. Good night, Molly. Oh. 